it's a big community. Uh, we just feel like it's a big neighborhood, you know, that we can just rely on people and just kind of have a good time. And For Miguel Gonzalez and Valeria Gonzalez, their family has lived in the Boston Square neighborhood for the past four years. Having a great time, even though it's a little cold, but we came out to support the community. So The neighborhood, presented as one of the most diverse neighborhoods in Grand Rapids by Amplify GR, held their second annual Christmas tree lighting in their neighborhood park. The new tradition, bringing people from all types of backgrounds into the historic community. We feel like we're part of a big family and, you know, just a big community. It feels amazing too, especially after COVID, after everything was closed. It's, it's nice to be together again. Diana might get that Christmas list get after all. Sheena Walls with In The Image. A lot of diversity over here in this neighborhood for all different kinds and that makes it so awesome. One of the tree lighting's partners spent her evening handing out sweatshirts to her neighbors. She speaks on the importance of community events like Saturday night's tree lighting. Spread the love through the community to uplift the community and in this time that we're going through with COVID passing and everything and just remember that Christmas is Christmas and it's the time for us to come together, fellowship and celebrate. For Kenneth W. Hoskins for Oak neighbors agreeing with Sheena Walls says positive community events grow positive neighborhoods. People want to be where excitement is at, where enthusiasm is at, and where there's not a whole lot of negativity. In Grand Rapids, Micah Cho, 13 on your side.